Well, it's like they they went for the short term win instead of the long term one, right? You got a lifelong patient with dialysis, or you get the money quick now, and it became the number one drug and sold in the world, right? Because for your audience, what these drugs do is they modify behavior. No drug in history has done it this effectively. You take that drug, you don't even care about eating. So the mm -hmm. amount of people in the line at Whataburger in Texas or McDonald's in Scottsdale has gone way down. And it, you can get it through insurance. Yes. Right. So 100%, I, 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 they're just kicking themselves in board meetings all the time. They're like, well, that's okay. They can just handle it like they handled peptides and just take them off the market and go, wait a minute. Well, that's why I, we I, need I, more regulation. How it's not been pulled. Like to me, you know, the peptide thing's a joke. Like peptides have been around forever. Ever. So like, okay, you you found something that you want to mess with. So now you're going to pull it. That's say, you know, it's like stem cell therapy. Like it, there's nothing super complicated about this. You you can make it sound super complicated and and make it a patient safety issue or make us think you're making it a patient safety issue, which is not. It's more of a money issue. You want yeah. to monopolize. Yeah. And control that particular um therapy yeah that you can you can benefit from i get it I, we, we're not like right. damn 